Hey there, electricity enthusiasts. Welcome back to another electrifying episode of Electricity Frenzy. I'm your host, and today we've got a shockingly interesting topic to dive into. What happens when you run a 220 volts fan on a 110 volts outlet? Trust me, it's more than just a plug and play situation. Before we get into the nitty gritty, let's quickly revisit what voltage is. Voltage is the electric potential difference between two points, in our case, the power outlet and our fan. Now, your typical household outlets in the USA provide 110 volts, but some appliances, like this fan, are designed to work with 220 volts. So, what happens when we mix and match these voltages? Well, folks, it's not as simple as it just won't work. There are some serious consequences you need to be aware of. Firstly, if you connect your 220 volts fan to a 110 volts outlet, it won't run as efficiently as it should. The fan is designed to operate at a specific voltage, and reducing that can lead to a significant drop in performance. You might notice slower fan speeds and less airflow. Now, here's where it gets interesting, overheating. The fan's motor is calibrated to handle a certain voltage. When you lower the voltage, the motor has to work harder, generating excess heat. This can lead to a shorter lifespan for your fan and, in extreme cases, could even pose a fire hazard. Safety first, always. Let's not forget about the internal components. The reduced voltage can cause damage to the fan's electronic circuits, digital display, and other sensitive parts. It's like asking your car to run on the wrong type of fuel, it's just not built for it. Now that we've seen the potential pitfalls, how can we prevent this from happening? Always check the voltage requirements of your appliances before plugging them in. If you've got a 220 volts fan and a 110 volts outlet, consider using a step-up transformer to match the voltages. It's like a compatibility bridge for your electronics. And there you have it, folks. Running a 220 volts fan on a 110 volts outlet might seem like a quick fix, but it's a recipe for trouble. If you enjoyed this electrifying episode, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and ring the notification bell to stay updated on all things electricity. Until next time, stay plugged in, stay safe, and keep the voltage flowing.